Hey you, it's not KDU, it's me. I am a first year medical student, but I absolutely love KDU. She is an amazing YouTuber and several months ago, she uploaded a video on how to make professional attire not boring because otherwise you're doing it wrong. So as a first year medical student, I have my clinical campus week coming up in just two weeks. And in addition to frantically practicing how to take a social history, how to take vitals, I'm also struggling to figure out what I should be wearing under my white coat so that I come off as being confident and surprisingly there are literally only four videos here on YouTube that talk about white coat outfits and give ideas on what to wear. I haven't been able to find a video that I really love. I like to be professional while at the same time not sacrificing my style and my individuality because a large part of that is going to play into my own confidence. So today I will be putting together five outfits for my clinical campus week where I married some of the tips that KDU gave as well as some other videos that I've seen talking about business casual wear and hopefully this will give you guys some ideas as to what you can wear under your white coat but if you are not in med school or you don't have a white coat these outfits are also perfect for other jobs where you might have to dress up a little bit and I've also made these outfits very fall themed because we're into that season now and I wanted to have a color palette that felt very warm and cozy so that's why you'll see a lot of brown a lot of um, muted greens and as I mentioned earlier a large part of putting an outfit together is accessories that is why I am super excited to partner with today's sponsor Ana Luisa <laughs> Ana Luisa is a jewelry brand that really prides itself in sustainability. They are water neutral, carbon neutral, and the designs that Ana Luisa has is very elegant, very classic, but at the same time still very unique. They have such a variety of different designs that you will definitely find something that suits your style. And for us med students, money is always tight, so Ana Luisa has a range of different prices starting at just $39. But if this is still out of your budget, Ana Luisa will also have sales year round to make these pieces a lot more affordable. Ana Luisa's shipping time is also super fast, so I was able to get my hands on the jewelry in just a few days. Their shipping is also free for orders over $50. Prior to this, I had actually owned a few Ana Luisa pieces myself, and I got them as a treat after I submitted my med school application and completed the majority of my med school interviews. So I was really, really excited to receive them because I had heard a lot of good things about them. So it's been a year now, and I haven't noticed any tarnishing or scratches, and my ears are super super sensitive but I haven't noticed any allergic reaction and that makes me pretty happy because I don't want to be going around scratching my ears the whole time. Ana Luisa actually partners with a lot of my favorite youtubers so why I was very excited to be able to own some Ana Luisa pieces myself. I'm actually wearing one of their pieces right now. I believe this is the Ash Double in partnership with Ashley Choi. She is another youtuber and I really really love her too. I actually got a few compliments on these earrings yesterday when I wore them to see my first standardized patient. So if you're looking for jewelry pieces that are versatile, elegant, and classic that you can wear to formal events where you can dress them up or for more everyday wear where you can dress them down. Or if you're looking for a gift for your loved ones for the upcoming holidays or for graduation, please check the description box down below for a link to Ana Luisa's website and use my promo code NINUIN10 for 10% off your order. And I would never recommend anything that I also don't love myself. So be sure to check out Ana Luisa. All right, let's get to the outfits. All right, first outfit. I would describe this one as being a very strong chic outfit. So starting with the base, I have on a cream sleeveless top that makes it so that when I'm wearing my blazer or my white coat, it's not going to get too stuffy and the sleeves are not gonna roll up on me. As for the bottoms, I have on these deep military green cropped trousers that cinches perfectly at the waist to give me the hourglass figure because oftentimes when you wear larger blazers or white coats, your figure can get lost and this helps me to fix 
fix that problem. Then I threw on this brown blazer because I wanted to channel that warm fall vibes. And to go with that, I also rolled up the sleeves just to make everything more streamlined. Those three quarter sleeves are going to make you look a lot more stylish. And I put on these brown leather boots to bring back that brown that I have on top. Also, everything that I put together today was actually thrifted except for the accessories. Here I'm also accessorizing with Ana Luisa, their ash double earring, and their tennis necklace, which I absolutely love because it is so simple yet so elegant with all the little diamonds that are on it. And here is that look when I'm wearing my white coat. In my next outfit, I am bringing in the burgundy. This is another one of my favorite fall colors. On top, I actually went for a layered look. So on the inside, I have on a sleeveless black vest and on the outside, I have the burgundy cardigan. This one, I would actually recommend going for a thinner cardigan, but this is what I had at the moment. So I just wanted to show you guys how this can be paired to give a more interesting look than normal. I also threw on a black belt because again, I want to coordinate with another piece that I have on, which is the top. And I actually learned how to tie the belt this way from Helen Lumiere, I believe that's how you pronounce her name. Um, I love her fashion videos, so I'll link her in the description box down below. You guys have to check her out and on the bottoms I have these very loose and comfortable wide leg pants and I love the flow of it when I'm walking around and then for the shoes I have on these two inch wide block heels that gives me the added height that I really need because I am only 5'2". For the accessories I showed you guys the tennis bracelet earlier but now I'm going to show you guys how versatile Ana Luisa is by showing you guys a different way to wear it. Here I am taking off the lower part of the earrings and then putting them on to the necklace. This way I bring a little bit more interest to the necklace and change things up a little bit. I think it gives a very interesting vibe and because it is a little bit busier on the bottom it makes perfect sense that the earrings are now more simple on the top. If you're not a fan of the layer look, here is that same look but without the burgundy cardigan. This one gives me a lot more of a casual vibe but still looking very chic. To make this a little bit more interesting, I I did keep the way that I styled the necklace, but also threw on this beautiful YSL blazer that I thrifted at a, a thrift store in Seattle. And I rolled up the sleeves so that I can kind of bring in that tan from the pants um, up to the top as well. This outfit is very simple, but it makes me feel so confident. And I think it's because of the shoulder pads that are on it, emphasizing that strength. The third outfit is a full pattern power suit brown outfit. Oh, I was a little bit nervous putting this one together because it's giving me major 80s vibes. It reminds me of something that my mom would have worn back in the days, but for some reason, I actually really love this one. These pants, I was a little bit hesitant on getting them at first because they have a very interesting shape, but I love how loose it is and the creeping pattern that is going on at the waistline is a little bit more of a visual interest because this is pretty much a one colored suit so I wanted to make it a little bit interesting somehow. And then for the shoes, I'm actually bringing in these mustard yellow heels. They're pretty short, but they have this square toe that I really love because this one is a much more masculine outfit. I kind of wanted to channel the energy, but also bring it down a little bit by putting on this bracelet, which reminds me a lot of the thin watches that's been very popular lately. And I took off the necklace because I thought it would be too busy otherwise since there are a lot of bold statements going on in this outfit and finally for my last look this one I feel like is a lot more classic it kind of looks like I just came out of a k-drama um, and I think it's because of the coat that I'm wearing the coat is actually from Gap I did not thrift this one but it's something that I've had in my closet for a very long time so I thought I would bring it out because this outfit is a lot more simple than the 80s one from before I threw the necklace back on just to give a little bit more 
more of a visual interest. Again, I'm reusing the cream sleeveless top from earlier, but threw on some navy pants. So you might notice that a lot of these outfits look similar when I put on my white coat. So that's why I try to play it up a lot with the pants that I'm wearing. Because when you're wearing your white coat, most of the time your top is gonna be covered. So where I feel like I can really make a statement is in the type of bottoms that I'm wearing as well as what shoes I am wearing. All right, those are the five white coat outfits that I put together for my clinical campus week. I hope you found this video helpful. And I know as a med student, it's kind of weird for me to make a fashion video, but if you liked this video and you want me to do more of these types of videos, please comment below and give me a thumbs up. I wouldn't say that I know a lot of about fashion, but I do love expressing myself through my style and I would be more than happy to do more of this type of content for you guys. So again, if you are interested in picking up some Ana Luisa pieces yourself, please check the link in the description box and use my promo code NINUIN10 for 10% off your order. That is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, best wishes, warmest regards. Until next time, bye.